Hi guys and a warm welcome back to my channel. This is my handsome little three-year-old son, Caden Gustav, and this is how he's twist out. It's currently looking one week and a bit after wash day. Today I'm gonna show you guys how I refresh the style, all the products that I use on his extremely thick type 4C hair, as well as how I handle his thick hair too. If you guys wanna see how I refresh the style, please keep on watching this video. my subscribers what your name is? Kaden. Kaden who? Gustav. Kaden Gustav. Is Mom. mommy fixing your hair today? Kaden Gustav Miranda. Yeah, that's your name. So is, is mommy fixing your hair today? Yes. Yeah, mommy can see your Aina. Let me see your Aina. Where's your Aina? Where did you bump your head today? Show me. In the water and it's slippery. Yeah, the bathtub was super slippery and fell. Mm -hmm. Okay, so let's fix your hair, okay? You're gonna be a good boy? Mm -hmm. Okay, baby. Here. Yeah. Is that the brush? Are you giving mommy the brushy? Mm -hmm. Hey guys, so I'm just gonna carry on and do a voiceover so that the video is not too long. But this is my little, little baby's hair um, a week off the wash day and it's a little dry and matted so what I'm gonna do is remove the wool that I tied his hair with the week before it's only been a week and there's already a bit of length there so first of all let's just rehydrate the hair with some water this is just an old dark and lovely spray bottle <laughs> that we put water in and I'm just lightly removing the lint and separating the hair with my fingers just like a light um, detangle before I really go in and really detangle the hair um, the water is super important you cannot comb the hair without water guys it's gonna tug and pull and he's gonna get really upset <laughs> with me so I'm gonna go in with a leave in which is the native child's milk and honey moisturizing detangling conditioner guys if you guys watched his previous wash day yes I am still using this product it is working wonders for his hair and then this is where I'm gonna go in and start to detangle as you can see i'm holding the hair pretty taut so that it's not tugging and pulling once again he's three and you if you have a little kid that is three you know that just a little bit of tugging is enough for him to escape okay to try to escape <laughs> and you guys saw so i added an extra moisture um to the kitchen at the back there because that hair really gets super super tangled and then i'm going in with a favorite a personal favorite dark and lovely all natural afro moisturizing butter this is also a, a living but it's so thick um that i use it as an actual moisturizer and just to steal in all of that moisture this is the native choice coconut oil it's deodorized um coconut oil and yeah guys i'm just making sure to coat the hair from root to ends and then last but not least this is the organ oil with baobab oil strength strengthening anti breakage gel this gel is super moisturizing as well it's not super it doesn't have like a cost to it um and it's not drying as well so yeah guys and i'm just gonna tie that up with a piece of string which is wool to wool that i pre-cut before i started filming 
and my fingers are super slippery I'm gonna fumble a little bit here <laughs> because of all the oils and the moisturizers that are currently in my hair and yeah guys I'm pretty much using two of the same products I was using last year and with the addition of the argan oil um, gel and uh, the nature's choice coconut oil this is my first time using this this brand and it's 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 working pretty well so i'm just tying the um, wool and then cutting off the excess wool and then i'm going to go ahead and detangle it again before i go ahead and twist the hair moisture moisture is very important guys and also i find that when the hair is super wet you can get the twists to be super like a uh, thin as to as opposed to when the hair is dry and yeah guys i'm just basically smoothing and adding gel as i get towards the end so that the, the ends um stay closed up and they don't unravel too quickly just going there twisting the ends again just to make sure that the um, ends don't unravel and yeah guys that's pretty much how I refurbish <laughs> not refurbish basically how I refresh his hair um, he's got really thick type 4b 4c hair um, it is it's 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 tough guys it's tough to to kind of uh, make sure that it stays moisturized etc but i do the best that i can and um, just separating the hair the way that i that that it is in this moment really works wonders for me when i have to refresh it, it works wonders for me when i have to wash his hair i do have to do a revised wash day routine because the way i washed his hair last year and the way i wash his hair currently is totally different i do a whole lot of prep before we even get into the water so i'm crossing my fingers that i'll have time to film that um, in the up and coming week or maybe i can split it into two videos where i do a full detangling and then a wash day or i just do it all at once and kill two birds with one stone but i guess we'll just see um <laughs> what i decide to do but yeah guys what i did to the one side i'm doing to the other i may look like i'm being a little rough but i'm really not <laughs> it just looks super rough and <laughs> super uh what you call it aggressive because it's sped up but I'm actually being super gentle. My child is a little Leo, okay? He's feisty, so any slight movement or tugging, he's gonna let me have it, he's going to let me know <laughs> that I am doing the most. So yeah, the fact that he's sitting really calm well, means that I'm being super careful and super gentle and making sure that I'm just detangling as slowly and as carefully as I possibly can. Anyways, guys, I talk a hell of a lot, <laughs> uh, as you all know, so I'm just going to keep quiet and basically let you guys watch the rest of this video on your own. But you guys can see the sheen and the shine when I'm done. The hair is super moisturized and rehydrated and yeah, prepared for the next week before i wash his hair i wash caden's hair every two weeks so yeah guys guys apparently this is the new medium at mcdonald's are you kidding me this is freaking super size dude this is super size you guys were supposed to say a boy toy she just took she just gave the toy at the door the audacity You want some chips? There you go. I'm going to hold them. Okay, guys, so I went ahead and done the other two because I'm doing six. And this is how we're looking. Um, as you guys saw, lunch just arrived. So Caden's enjoying his nuggets and french fries. And yeah, 
almost done. I'm gonna turn them over and then we're gonna do the front section of his hair, right? Mm -hmm. We're almost done. He's eating, he's living his best life right now. I'm hungry. I'm hungry. I'm just forcing myself <laughs> I'm to eat. starving, yeah. I'm forcing myself to eat this Vianna so that I don't open the oh, burger. Yeah, we need to watch just while, one hour. eat while we watch. It's just one hour. One hour seems like a lifetime right now. <laughs> I've got hunger go. pains. I'm going to go watch these videos. The hunger pains are just... <laughs> Can I have a chippy, please? Um, mm. Mm. Very. Mm -hmm. I'm hungry. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Just to add on, guys, if anybody has any questions that they want to ask me with regards to Caden's hair please do direct them to the comment section below um, like I said Caden is three years old he's turning four in August this year and I have never cut his hair from birth <laughs> until now and will I ever cut his hair yes I will when Caden wants his hair to be cut I will definitely cut his hair it's his hair um, I just want to raise him to have his own thoughts and just choose what he wants for himself and how he wants to see himself and what makes him feel comfortable um, and right now he loves his hair and so yeah we're gonna grow it until he decides he wants to cut his hair or he wants a different style and yeah Caden's got type 4B, 4C hair, and it's extremely thick and demanding, but we're managing, guys. So if anybody has any questions and just wants to, you know, chop it up with regards to anything in the comment section below, please don't be shy. <laughs> please do hit me up. Um, I would love to get to know all of my subbies um we're growing we're growing we're growing slow and steady but we're growing nonetheless and i am grateful for each and every one of you guys so yeah guys let me know holler at your girl <laughs> and one last thing guys if you guys have any video requests if you guys would like to, me to make any type of video um if you guys would like to see anything please do direct it in the comment section below too that'll be amazing to just all just get involved in the content that i create for you guys everything that i create is for you guys um and also because i do love i generally love hair and i've loved doing hair my own hair since like the eighth grade that's when my passion for hair started to grow so everything i do is for my subbies and for myself as well so yeah guys it's i think it'll be amazing to just chop it up and come up with ideas together and just brainstorm on what we could you know make and create and whatever like let's just get involved and yeah guys let me know if you guys want to see a specific type of video from me um, now that I've relaxed my hair too, <laughs> hit me up, hit me up, let me know. Okay guys, I'm going to let you watch the remainder of the video. We're almost at the end of the refreshing of little guy's hair. So yeah.
And swallow your food. You're just packing all it all in there. Huh? Mm -hmm. Look at me. Look at the camera. Okay. And we're all done. Do you like your hair? Mm -hmm. Does it look lovely? Mm -hmm. Guys, so we're finally done. All in all, refreshing his hair takes me about. It takes me 30 minutes to refresh his hair. Um, I'm gonna be washing it next week. I do have to do a revised wash day because the last time that I did a wash hair, um, that was last year, it's been a year, and a lot has changed. So um, I'm definitely gonna make a video about when I take these babies down and I wash his hair. And yeah, hopefully that will be up next week. <laughs> I don't wanna say it exactly will be, Cause I don't know if I'm gonna wash, I'm gonna film this specific wash day, but if I do, it's gonna be in the next video. And yeah, so this is the kind of style that he's, he that he currently he usually stays in. Um, I've decided because wash day has gotten so hectic as the more his hair has grown. <sighs> so these six twists really don't take a lot of time. Um, and yeah, they do take some maintenance because I do retwist it about once a week after he bathes because they unravel. But it's so cute. Um, he can literally, this can be for any event, you know, school. It's very neat. Um, and yeah, do you, do you like your hair, Kaden? Does it look nice now? It's super neat. So yeah, guys, this is all the products. Mm -hmm. These are all the products that I used on his hair today. I will put them in the description box below if you guys want it's to. Awesome. Yeah. If you guys want to purchase it for your children's hair as well. And yeah, guys, that's about it from me and my little Gustav. Cool. My little Kaden. Um, guys, I just opened a, an Instagram page for him in December. It's pretty recent and I suck at posting, but do go follow him. <laughs> I promise I will be posting more content. Um, as time goes, goes by and guys, please do subscribe to my channel Comment any questions that you may have in the comment section below like this video share it if you care And of course be sure to click on the notification bell so that you're notified when I post this video And all of that is completely free guys and it will definitely help me and it will push me through the algorithm So thank you so much for your support and I'll catch you guys in the next video. Bye <laughs>